Hello and welcome back. Today will be more of a corrections and uh, retractions and reanalysis video in the process of researching streaks or beach ridges as I found out they're called or strand planes. Um, this type of phenomenon. Uh, I, uh, I found out uh, a lot of stuff I probably learned in elementary school and middle school and all that, high school, but uh, I just brushed up on coastal morphology and coastal formation and geology and geography and stuff like that. So um, in the process of uh, doing all that research, I... Uh, I realized that some of the stuff I said about um, coastlines may not be very accurate. You know, it's worth speculating, but I think some of my speculations are wrong, so in some cases. So, and then also I, I found some stuff uh, that makes me more confident in other examples. So, again, like two steps back, one step forward for this video. Um, so I may have gotten a little trigger happy on the speculation about coastlines, that coastlines are machined or edited somehow. Uh, I still think they may be, but I'm, I'm, I would just say I'm, I'm not retracting much. I'm just less confident about some of the stuff I've said. Okay, so the first half of this video will be discussing all this uh, a bunch of research stuff here or uh, giving you a, a lesson on uh, a refresher on geology and coastal formation and all that stuff um, or just running you through the refresher I, I did for myself um, I don't I don't feel we can really continue without going through this the basics or some some basics otherwise we run the risk of being uh, sloppy and you know incomplete and so the first half of this video will be all this research and then um, the second half I will be uh, taking you through I rewatched I re all my the videos I've released so far and then went through and flagged some some examples that I want to uh, reanalyze and um, possibly retract in some cases so uh, and then there's a couple that I, I feel still feel strongly about so we'll look at those as well all right that, so that was the intro to uh, this video 12 a um, couple things I'd like to add uh, first, some parts of, um, well, video 12, I'm calling it, once again, the, the part numbers are arbitrary, but uh, it started as some research on uh, a couple things and then just kind of ballooned up. One thing led, led to another and it got out of hand. It was like eight hours of content. So I, I kind of broke video 12 up into uh, um, like several sub parts, I guess, um, just for to make it more consumable um and some parts of it are really boring <laughs> like i'm sorry it'll, it'll put you to sleep parts of it like especially so this is part zero it's just like an intro and uh part one is um a little bit more intro kind of repetitive and then uh um, some educational stuff and the educational stuff is pretty dang boring uh i don't know you can decide what you want to skip through but I skip over um, but yeah some some parts I didn't edit as tightly as other parts so it'll be like kind of feel like dragging your feet or it'll feel kind of drawn out or whatever I say um a lot you know whatever um, uh, and then other parts are like more crisp crisply edited with uh, almost feels like a, a presentation and uh, it's, even though it's really long like there's there's parts that like 
of really important points and it's, it's hard to highlight or flag where those points are. Like you kind of just need to watch all of it. If you're interested, interested in this content, um, kind of sucks, but cause it's, I mean, it's, there's so much other stuff you could be doing. Um, but yeah, so broken up, this is part zero. Part one is like the educational stuff. And then there's, um, more educational stuff. Um, miscellaneous examples, megalithic stuff and whatever. And I don't, I don't know why I included unrelated examples to the educational stuff, but just how it worked out. And then some reanalysis of my previous videos, um, as I mentioned a moment ago. And, and that's, and then I'll do like a part six of five, which will be an appendix of like just a couple additional miscellaneous things and uh which will have some uh important points as well um and then <laughs> i just i just uh i spent a, a while downloading i downloaded like five thousand images that i have to go through like all of them like related to the is history of plumbus uh, topic and it's like <laughs> there's so much to cover like too much. i almost want to just like not do it but uh, i don't even know whether i should be doing it like i almost feel like i got pied pipered into uh some big dead end line of uh study like all this, all this weird stuff on the the surface of the earth, and also in uh, historical structures, um, buildings, and whatever. Like, it, I think it was put there for multiple reasons, like, like ten reasons at once. Like, it it straddles um, many purposes. So, I think one of those purposes was to get people to study it. So, or it's possible that that's the, that's the case. So if that is the case, then I'm an idiot for studying it and for spending so long doing it. So right now where I'm at, I'm like 50, 50, like whether I'm like being a sucker, like studying this stuff or whether I'm like onto something. And even if I am onto something, that doesn't mean you're not a sucker for uh, covering it. Um, so <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty torn. I don't, I don't know. I don't even know if this is something I should be doing. Like, obviously, if they, if there's such blatant examples of weirdness, then they did that partly as it serves. I don't know. I think I said it already. I don't know. Time will tell whether I'm wasting my time <laughs> or whether I got suckered. Not just me in particular, but just with the spending so long on this content when maybe I should be doing other stuff. I really have no idea what a should mean anyways. What should we do? What is life? What is what is a person? What is what is the world? What's the world? <laughs> um and then uh, that's it for now. All right. Thanks.